this should be a draw but i mean because i have bishop d4 i'm not 100 percent sure that it's an easy draw but now i go here see what he has i think all he has is kind of made some mistakes here mind you it's still probably a draw as i already said like 20 times um i can wait i can go here maybe wait let's go here this is actually getting very dangerous now okay this should be winning somehow for me actually isn't this just checkmate it's just checkmate very good very good okay um i'm gonna play sicilian again i thought i got a good position last game He's going to do this one again. Bishop b5. That's not supposed to be right. Can I just go here and takes or or b he does have e5 maybe kind of some weird line. B5 is obviously is b5 yeah, it's fine. Because the E5 I just take. Okay, it goes there. Just go maybe here. Plays rook D1. I can obviously go G6 and bishop G7, which is I think is what I should do. His knight is a little bit awkward on... Uh, do I have B4 here? Maybe, but I'll just castle. His knight is very awkward on A3. Let's go here. Um... Do I have b4 here again? 3, bc3, cd4, maybe. But I think I'm just going to play rook d8. And like queen b8 next move. Let's go queen b8. It's a3. Okay, it's a very strange game that we're playing here. I can take and go knight a5. b4 is right, but I'm going to try it. It's a very weird move, but I think it might be playable. Seems pretty balanced. We need a Dr. Selleck for the Prime. Thank you so much, Dr. Selleck. Appreciate it. Thank you. Did I get XQC's G Fuel Juice? Uh, not yet, no. Those queens there. I can play A5. I mean, I think A5 is right. I mean, I don't know. Is D5 his idea? He still can't go Bishop A2 because of B3. Plays Knight E1. I think I'm going to go Knight B6 here. Maybe D5 at the right moment also take i can also go let's just go a4 i'm sure it's wrong but i i want to play it okay let's go uh a3 is not good b3 is interesting three knight a5 very weird kind of grip i'm gonna play b3 i, I don't know this is good it looks kind of weird but it's also kind of interesting all at the same time and i, I like playing different stuff that's interesting as well as just what's absolutely 100 percent correct let's go here e5 queen c7 is fine okay he takes with the pawn oh he has rook a4 then i have rook c3 but no this was a mistake by me I'm trying to play interesting but I, i'm gonna get punished for this most likely i guess i do have e5 maybe let's go e5 here play queen e5 or rook e5 my instinct says queen e5 is right the other hand Rook e5 also makes sense because I have knight c4. Goes knight f3. I can just move the rook back. Just go back, play knight c4. Okay, I have knight e3. I also can trade. I think just looks fine just takes guess I take obviously and go like uh queen b6 makes sense bishop h6 also makes sense how do I do this wait a second I gotta think here um and why am I thinking? I just got. I just got to move. Why am I thinking so long here? I 
I'm gonna go here, maybe bishop g3. Uh, let's go here, maybe, and king g7. Let's just uh, go here and rook, rook here. Oh, he's, not, he's just got queen a4. Um, yeah, I just misplayed this. Wait, ah, no, no, don't go that way. Go this way. Oh, I got to move. I just have no time. Oh, let's go here. Yeah, I just I just have no time. I misplayed that. Yeah, that was frustrating. I should not have lost that game. I was much better out of the opening, but then in the middle game I kind of lost lost the thread. Think of crown EM for the two months. Lost the thread in that middle game. Frustrating. Let's go E4. Let's go here, here. Play this this line that Anish play, which is C3 D4. Go rookie one. Okay, knight b6. Now see, I didn't put the I didn't put my knight out, so I mean I don't know if this makes sense. He goes a5, he wants to go a4. I'll fix it. I don't know if this is right, but I'll do it. Okay, again I have knight f5 here if I want. I also can just play like h3. I don't love knight f5, but it's again not a terrible move. I think I'm just gonna go queen c2 though. And, and knight f5 next move, maybe? Oh, I can also take and go knight g5, I just realized. So queen f7. I've misplayed this takes. Bishop b3. I'm playing it like this. I'll do it and play queen e2, I guess. Let's go here. It's actually <clears throat> complicated. I bishop eight. <clears throat> Sorry, you guys, one second. Um, H six, queen g five, takes takes seven, queen a four. Queen h5. Wait, why am I, again? I'm thinking way too long. Just go here. Oh, I can just take and I can just take. I have check and takes, of course. I guess I can, I mean, I can obviously just take, but I'll just go knight f3 here. Let's go here, maybe queen e2, knight h4 next move. I'm going to go g4. I'm sure this is bad, but... Let's just take and go here. Go h4. Don't know if this is right. I mean, I feel like I'm misplaying this somehow. I mean, maybe I can take and take at some point. g6, knight h6 looks winning for me. His pawns are very bad, which is important. Let's go here. Plays h5. Actually, again, this is I should not have allowed this either. Um... I'm going to go here and king h2, maybe. He has queen g4, but I just take and run the king up. Yeah, I've totally bungled this one also. What am I doing? Let's 
go here. Try to reroute my knight, maybe. Let's try to reroute the knight to f3 and g5, maybe. I also... Okay, let's just go... Um, just go here, maybe. And I just got rook f7. Rook f3, I just take. Oh, no, it doesn't... Oh, my gosh, it doesn't even work. But I have king h2, king h1. Okay, misses it. Let's just go, like, here, I guess. Let's go here. What am I doing? Again, I feel like I, I'm just like, I'm not, I'm just messing this up is what I'm doing. Uh, what am I doing? Just panicking and throwing hard. Oh, I'm just, why am I, again, why am I, why am I unable to move? I'm suddenly unable to move. I don't know why. I mean, he has check and it's still a draw i guess but oh i just hung a pawn oh my gosh whoops um so like here Okay, I can play e6. I'm just going to trade. Oh my god, what was that? Oh my god. Oh my god. My mouse. My mouse got stuck. I don't believe that. My mouse got stuck again. I messed that up. Okay. They caused me binoculars for 12 months. Let's go here and here. My mouse started getting stuck at the end. Now, I'm not saying that's the reason that I lost, but it did start getting stuck there. That's really upsetting because I was actually just winning that game. Just castles. Unbelievable. Let's go here in rookie eight. If I don't, if I don't hang my, if I don't hang my, um, my knight and bishop there, I win. I do think I need to get a new mouse though. I actually do think I need, need to get a new mouse. Um, joking aside, let's go B5, knight of eight, knight E6 here. Okay. I can play knight E6, F6 here, maybe H6 as well. Frustrating. Queen prevent the pre moves? No, actually, I didn't get I didn't get any pre moves. That was kind of the point. I was trying to get the pre moves in, but my mouse got stuck, which is why there was that one point when I tried to put the um, I think it's when I tried to put the knight on d4, it got stuck, but it's fine. Here come all the mouse experts. Indeed, indeed. Uh, he goes a4. I'm gonna go knight d4 and takes. Maybe bishop b6. If I take with the pawn, I have f5. Um. I'm going to do it anyway. I know I'm giving up a pawn here, but I kind of trust that somehow I have counterplay. Okay, let's see. I can play bishop b6 here, which I will. Queen f3. Now, I can obviously take the pawn. I can move my queen to f6 as well. Do I take or not is a question. I think I should take. Go rook f8 and bishop f5. Don't like my position though. That last game really cost me. I can play queen d5. I can also take maybe. I don't know which way he's trying to castle. That's also the other question, big question mark here. I'm just gonna go here. So I mean, if he goes this way, I take because he played a4, which was not actually super precise. I'll go this way too. 
But I mean, he can just castle. Now, what do I have exactly? Kind of nothing, because my bishop is misplaced. Let's go here. Maybe queen f8 next move. I also just give him knight g5. Okay, let's go here. So I'll go here. Should not have lost that last game. I can take the pawn on b5 here. I have rookie eight. Okay, but this I think is a mistake because now my bishop gets in at least. Mistake being maybe being the wrong word, but I think it's a slightly wrong move because now if my bishop gets back, I'm at least in the game. Doesn't mean I'm winning or anything, but it means I'm I'm in the game. So I think he was positionally close to winning before that. Okay, so I mean I have to take. I have queen f5 here with bishop d6. I also have rook e8 here. Rook e8, queen g4, rook e7. I think I have to play for counterplay. Oh, wait, rook e8's got queen e5. Oh my gosh, why am I so blind? Uh, rook e7 must be the move then. Yeah, let's just go here. Queen e5, bishop d6, and then rook e8. I have to play for counterplay. Although maybe I could have just gone bishop d6 too. Let's go here. Hope I'm not blundering something. I feel like I'm close to it. I do have queen e3. I think I can make a draw. Takes. I guess I just take. Uh, uh, bishop d6 or do I go b4 here? I can also take and... Maybe rookie th no rookie three just takes. Queen g4 I can take and take I guess. Queen h4 is a good move. Um, I don't really believe in my position here, but I have to try. Let's go here. I guess if I can get my king in, I should be okay. I'm definitely worse here. The only question is, am I losing or am I drawing? His pawn in h6 is kind of misplaced, I feel like. Yeah, I mean, this is the question. Am I losing this or am I drawing this? I'm going to fix the structure. I think this is just a draw. I'm not messing around. I could go g5 and try to win. I'm not messing around. So let's get back to this. So I had that winning position. No more messing around. Let's go here and here. And knight d2. He's going to do this one with castle. Let's play the same line. I thought I got a good position. There's knight b6 again. Okay. I think I'm going to go queen e2, rook d1, knight f1. Do something a little bit different this time. Thank you, too. Um, thank you for the six months. Appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, I, oh my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I could have just taken, taken, and gone queen h5. Oh, my gosh. Although, wait. He still gives me this option. Wait a second. He still gives me the option. So, let's, let's go for it. I mean, if it's no good, it's no good. But he does hang it. He, that's definitely a mistake. He definitely hung it. But... Whether he hung e5, but whether it's, I mean, because I wasted a tempo on it, it's maybe not as good as it could have been, but it still has to be good. Maybe f4 here. f4 is fine. Not really a move I want to play. I mean, knight f3 and e5 looks just fine. Like knight e4, maybe knight d4. Let's go here and here. Bishop g4, I have f3, so let's just take. Okay, let's go knight d4 back, hit the bishop. I have knight f5, but I think just rook e1 and knight f5. He's got rook f8 now, of course, which I completely forgot about. Go here, knight g3 maybe. 
We should see five logical. I think I can just play like B3 and takes. I hope I don't blunder. I feel like I'm very close to blundering every every game right now. Let's just take. Okay, so he does this. So I go here. Gets the knight to d5. I can play g3. I can also just go like knight e3 maybe. Let's go here. Go here. Hold the pawn. Play here. I have g3 maybe. Maybe f3, g3 also. I have h4 also. Okay, maybe just not. Actually, he wants, he wants to go c5. So I need to play rook d1 and then f3. Just need to be smart about my time usage here. I'm moving way too slowly. Okay, it does go g5, but now I think I can go... Oh, he just got knight d5, and I just have to make a draw. Unbelievable. Awful play by me. Absolutely awful. Just up a pawn and much better in this opening, and now I'm going to have to try to make a draw. Absolutely terrible. I shouldn't, I shouldn't, I shouldn't lose here, but that was inexplicable by me. Really, really poor. Okay, I can play h3 maybe. Yeah, let's play h3 and trade. And go like rook h2 maybe. This is a draw though. I think he has to go h5. We trade rook h2 and it's just going to be a draw. I think. Let's go here. Maybe I have rook h... No, rook h... H4 is an interesting move, maybe. Yeah, I go like Rook F1, and it's just going to be a draw again. But um, but um, but um. Can you actually? What am I doing? Wait, I'm kind of misplaying this somehow. What am I doing? I'm just actually really misplaying playing this. I have to go like here and King F2. This is a four, so of course I will take. Let's I just go here. He checks, and I go like king here. Maybe I go king f two anyway. I feel like I'm gonna lose this game because I, I know that I just blundered this. Let's go here. King g two is also better. I don't know why I didn't do king g two. Let's go here and make the draw. Okay, this is definitely a draw. I just have to be smart about how I do it. Let's go here. Or it should be a draw. Wait. Go here. Yeah, it's just a draw. Now I go here and it's a draw. Yeah, it's just a draw. Let's go again. Thank you to Chess Cuckoo for the um thank you to Chess Cuckoo for the uh thank you to Snapple Care. Thank you to Hulkidora. Thank you so much. Um let's go back to Sicilians. I was playing better in the Sicilians. I've gotten much better positions against him out of the Sicilian than anything else. He's gonna keep doing this. Okay. Let's go here. Okay, he's gonna do this again. I don't think it's right. Um, but we'll see. I think I'm just going to go g6 and bishop g7, maybe. I mean, he has knight 8. Okay, I'm not worried. Let's just castle. Probably I'll go, like, uh, a6 and at some point b5. Because d4 I can just take. I can take if he wants, I guess. Okay, it goes there. So I will just go here, I guess. Queen c7, b5. We're going to get a standard position again. b5, b4, knight d7. I go queen b7, or actually, I go knight b6 here. If f4, I play e6. It's going to be very similar to the previous game, I think, that we had earlier. Knight d5, I can take, but I think just queen b7 and e6 is good. They get a poker chest for the 19 months. Thank you so much to poker chest. Now, I can play a5. I can also trade. 
think A5 is still right, though. It looks right. I think I have e6. I think e6 is just fine. I just take. It was knight e3. Now I have d5. Whoa, thank you to why is the court call call for the five five subs? Thank you so much. I'm gonna go d5 and just open it up here. I can play rook d8 here, which looks completely fine. I can also just go like queen d7. I actually like that Alirez is playing this. It feels like he's trying to experiment more. I have rook d8 also. So many options. I really don't know what's best. I'm going to go here. Although now he's bishop b3. Now the knight e5. Still very tricky. Okay, he goes knight g4. Want some knight f6, knight f6 business, I guess. I can obviously go f5 if I want to. Um, do I want to? I think I do want to. And hopefully I don't blunder something. Because I, I feel like my position's pretty good here. Unless I'm blundering something, which I don't think I am. B3 is not... B3 and C4 actually is kind of a move here. But I'm just going to go here to be safe. Okay, 6 rook B8, of course. Goes H4, logical. C4 is a move. D4 is a move. I mean, D4 is what I want to play objectively. I can also take... Actually, maybe I just take and go D4. D3. Oh, man. I, again, I'm thinking too long. I'm thinking way too long here. Okay, let's just go rookie 8. Let's challenge the center. Okay. Let's take. I have 95 here at some moment. I can also just move my bishop. I think I'm going to go D4 here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close the side of the board. It's got to be right somehow. Again, though, I'm sure that I've misplayed this. I'm positively certain that I've misplayed this order. He goes C4, though. He doesn't actually go for any kind of attempt at punishment. But again, I'm down on the clock, and it's a very hard position to play. Let's go here. I want to go 95, maybe. Go knight e5, I thought. Wait, I have queen b7 to hit the rook. Important move. Very, very important move. Without queen b7, I'm losing. I mean, maybe I'm losing anyway. Maybe I'm losing. Wait, king g7, knight d6. So I have to take. I have rook e6. No, I have knight d7. Rook a7, rook e7. I think I'm losing somehow. I don't know how, but I feel like I'm losing. Let's go here and take. Oh, I had bishop e5 also. Maybe I pre-move it. I have to do this. Let's go here. Let's go here. Um, I think I played g5. Okay. I should be able to draw this somehow. But again, I have no time. Every time that I get into these situations, somehow I just have no time. Oh, I had bishop e7 also. Oh, bishop e7 was a move there. <sighs> bishop e7 was an obvious move. Such an obvious move there. Yeah, I mean, rook f1. Yeah, I just... I mean, I'm, I'm going to resign this in a second. Yeah, I'm just... Yeah. I'm, I'm messing up. I'm messing up. I'm actually just playing badly. I am. I, I've been better every game with Black out of the opening, but I've, I've gotten panicky in these late middle games. And when I'm missing the lines... King J8 was a draw instead of taking the knight? Wait, instead of King J8 was a draw? Wait, why was King G8 a draw? Yeah, let's focus. Let's do this again. Oh, it's 2-0 Madrid. Okay, Madrid over Barca. Okay, let's, 
Again, I don't believe in this line. I, I think Ali Reza keeps playing it, and I don't think it's right. Okay. He's going to do it again. I mean, again, this is obviously not good for Black. But I have yet to punish him for it. So let's just drop back. Oh, I had Queen B3. <laughs> Queen B3, and I just win the game. Okay, that's a pure sign that I'm not playing well. I saw Queen B3, and then I didn't play it. Queen B3, Knight F7, and he just resigns. Wow. unbelievably poor by me see h3 is a move let's play h3 okay can play e5 i can also go like queen e2 queen e3 maybe just have to get this knight out of here let's go here <sighs> let's go here maybe knight d4 next move stay locked in well it's not really a matter of staying locked in i'm just i'm missing tactics and i don't know why i'm missing them i'm just missing them like i saw like i saw queen b3 check winning the game and then somehow in my mind when he castled i just I just like, okay, he just doesn't work somehow. I like, I saw it and I didn't play it. Okay, let's go knight f1. I'm still better here at least, but it's not anything to write home about. Okay, bishop c5 is logical. Again, he's trying to go over this position where he's down a pawn. Um, again, you know, if, if, if it's good for him, it's good for him. I don't really care. I'll let him take um, if he wants to. Okay, now I have 94, though. Wait, now I have 94, maybe. Bishop b6, though. Let's go here. Maybe bishop g5. This actually is pretty good. I like queen g4. I think it's a good move. Maybe. Although, he's queen f7 again. I mean, again, it's not ideal. Wait, isn't that just a blunder? Okay, this, I mean, okay, if this doesn't work, then so be it. Like, I go here, 96. Okay, I'm going to win this game. Yeah, this is winning. Let's make sure there's no nonsense, like 93, but I don't see it. Let's make sure. Doesn't exist. Knight f4, I take. 93, I take, and I take. Yeah, this is just winning. Once I take the bishop, I mean, there's nothing he can really do here. I also have rook f1 to hit the queen next move. And, okay, goes for it. So I take. So I take. Yeah, okay, he goes bishop f4, but I mean, this... Okay, just no non. Also, you know what? Why didn't I just go rook f1? That would have been a little bit cleaner. Let's play knight e6, maybe. I also have just queen f3. Yeah. I'm gonna go knight a5 c5. Okay, let's go knight a5 c5 next move. Trade. Um, I think knight e c6 is supposed to be the right move. Or is it knight c4? No, actually, you just take and go here. I'm gonna just go rook c8. At some moment, I have d5, maybe knight c4, maybe knight c6 as well. Queen b6 next move, which is pretty playable um, also. Okay, I can play knight c6 maybe. I mean, knight c4 is the move I want to play, but then he goes b3. Again, I should kind of just focus on... I can also go knight a... Okay, let's, let's just do it and go knight a3. Because he can't go here because he takes. And once I get the two bishops, it's not wonderful, but I should be better. 
Although he also can't move the bishop. I should keep that in mind. So let's just keep developing. Because the bishop is stuck here. Knight c6 is a move. Knight b1 is still a move. Queen b6 is also pretty reasonable here. I guess I just have to make a draw, kind of. I have to just settle. Um, c1, rook c1. Just take. Takes with a rook. I mean, rook c5 is fine. It's headed for a draw. He can't take, so I just take. He has no knight moves. I take. Does he have queen g3 or something really weird? No, then I have rookie four, okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to make a draw here. How drawn is this actually? Wait a second. Is this a clean draw? I'm not so sure because I have bishop d4 actually. I was just thinking for a second here. This should be a draw, but I mean, because I have bishop d4, I'm not 100% sure that it's an easy draw. It's definitely a draw with correct play, but now I go here. See what he has. I think Ali Rez has kind of made some mistakes here. Mind you, it's still probably a draw, as I already said like 20 times. So he takes. I take. King has to go into the corner. Again, I'm sure it's a draw with correct play, but it's a little bit tricky for white to play. Love it when the opponent rejects a draw then ends up losing. Yeah, I'm not going to lose, which is why, I mean, I, it's one way. Either either I win or I draw, but there's no way that Ali Reza can win here. So that's why I 100% decline the draw, because if you if there really are no realistic losing chances, you never want to take a draw there. Uh, let's make sure. I think this looks correct. Okay, goes King H2. I mean, again, I feel like I should have mating chance, like Rook F1 or something. Let's just go back. Oh, but I gave him Bishop D6. Of course, Ali Reza sees it. Very unsurprisingly. Let's go here. I'm trying to create some weird Bishop G1, though. There's still this play. And I'm up 30 seconds on the clock. Um, I can... Wait, I can go here, maybe. Wait, let's go here. This is actually getting very dangerous now. I mean, he has a... F okay, this should be winning somehow for me. Actually, isn't this just checkmate? It's just checkmate. Very good. Very good. Very, very good. Let's keep going. Let's play e4. Um, I'm going to play the same thing. That was actually very good. Okay, he play, so he plays it in the other order now. So I'm going to go knight c4 here. We need 7, logical. I have knight h4. I'm just going to go rookie 1. I guess I'll just trade probably if he plays knight b6. Yeah, let's just trade. Play h3. Pretty dry. From draw to mate, yeah. I can go a4. I can also, I mean, I think I'm just going to go b3 here. I don't know if I want to go a4 or a5 or not, or I want to go c4, d5. Kind of a weird position. He plays c5 himself. d5 is obviously an option. I don't really want to play it. Bishop e3 is also obviously an option, as is a4. a4 is also an option. I'm not going to play a4 here, though. I'm going to go queen e2. Also, I'm moving way too slowly. I've got to speed up here. Let's go here. Hikaru could be better when he gets a new mouse. Uh, yeah, I am going to put in a request for a new mouse pretty soon with TSM. Thank you, Magnus Line, for the Prime. Thank you so much. Because it definitely is one of those things. Like, it's it, it definitely is... It, it seems to be an issue. Um, I don't know if Rook D1 is right, but I, I am actually going to go G4 if he plays Bishop H5. Let's go Knight H4. Probably he goes G6. But then I maybe also have a four. I mean, I'm I'm gonna go c4. This is very committal playing c4 here. Now he goes 97. I'm gonna try to play this like a Bobby Fisher. Let's try to play like a Bobby Fisher and get a good bishop against a bad knight concept. It might not work, but it's it, we're gonna try to be like Bobby Fisher.
Okay, so this is okay, so this is very Bobby Fisher ask. Okay, I can go Queen F3 maybe and Rook D5. At least that's my idea. But again, it, it already feels like somehow I've gone wrong. Like I had a window there maybe of like one move where it was where it's better. D8, Rook D8, Rook D8. Let's go for this. I'm gonna go G4, G5, I think. Okay, he's trying to go. I mean, I'm gonna go for it. Maybe it's no good, but I'm gonna try. It's very. This is extremely committal by me, but I think it's correct. Because so I think if my king gets to here and I get Rook G1, I mean, I suspect that I have enough play. Maybe I just don't, but I'd be very surprised if I don't. Let's go here. But I mean, again, he has Knight D4 and. Exactly. Where is my checkmate? I don't have one, so it didn't. So I messed it up. Very impressive by me. Okay, plays ninety seven. I thought the other one was much better. Um, this is just terrible for me. Okay, let's go here in F four, maybe. I guess I just go F four takes and hope. That's all I can really do. If e4, I have bishop f2, maybe. And then rookie 2. Again, I don't know why I went into this endgame. I thought I thought I had chances to uh to to be much better, but it's just not working out for me. It was there. The queen h4 is obviously a move. Oh I, knight of oh wait, no, I thought he had knight of five. Oh my god, I almost just blundered that. It's okay, let's just take and go queen here hmm the good thing is his pawns are all in dark square so if I play this correctly I should be able to draw this so rook d I think rook d1 is the right move because knight f3 I go king h1 and then like okay, let's go here so if I take I can just go check and draw he's also way down on the clock here I mean, this should just be a draw. Just have to play this correct. Oh, h4 is probably an awful move by me. Now, I can obviously take... I'm just going to put the pawn on h5. I mean, okay. Yeah, what am I doing? I just misplayed this. Okay, I have to go here. Let's take. Let's go here. Okay, this still should be a draw if I play this correctly. I gotta go. Uh, where's my rook? It's there. Okay, let's go check. It's just a draw. I'll offer him a draw here. I mean, is he, is he really trying to win this? I'm a little confused. Yeah, okay. Let's go again. I think you know that slothy for the prime. Bad game, but I get the draw out of it. So I can't really be that upset about it. Let's go here. Okay, let's play B5. Just take. Knight c3, I go knight a5. He plays a4. This one, I think d5 is correct with knight a5 and knight b3. Minus one point, yeah. I mean, the rating really doesn't matter because here draws don't cost me anything. So it's just like the wins are all that matter. Okay, go knight a5. I hit the, hit the bishop. Bishop g5. Now that, however, is a very strange move. I'm gonna take. I know this is supposed to be fine for me. I think I just take and take. He takes, I go here and I take, and I mean white is up a pawn here, but it's very kind of dry. Okay, so I take. I thought I had bishop e2, maybe. I think I do have bishop e2. I mean I guess he has knight d2 or something, then rook b8. Who's knight c3? 
to simplify. I mean, I can obviously trade everything down here. Let's think about how I want to play this. Bishop f3, gf3. I don't have knight, bef knight before bishop e7 is a, is a slight problem, although it's not really a I don't really think it's a problem because I can just take and go bishop f8. Yeah, I just take and go here. Should be a draw. Just take. Another draw from down a juicer. Um, yeah, I mean, it should, should be a draw because his pawns aren't great here. He's up a pawn. But his double pawns are split. Everything is kind of wide here. Checks a block. Yeah, I mean, I can obviously just. Which one do I take? I think I just take this one and go here. I mean, he can he can still try to win, I guess. But I'm not really seeing. I mean, knight d1. Yeah, it just goes knight e4 now. I think I just take. And if knight g5, I go rook a5. Yeah, it's just gonna be a draw. Yeah, it's just a draw. Very exciting. Um, let's play something else. I feel like every game we've played has been E4. Let's go here. Um, which line do I want to play? I mean, I can obviously go Bishop C3. I can also, I guess I'll just take and castle maybe. It's castle. This is the Catalan, yeah. Uh, thank you to ZTS for the prime. Who's ready for another draw? <laughs> well, chess is ultimately, you know, at the end of the day, it is a it is a draw with correct play. There's not much you can do about it. Um, I'm gonna go ninety five, maybe a three. Maybe just rookie one e four. Let's play a three and b four here. I don't really want to let him get bishop b four. I remember that's always some kind of weird issue in these lines. I can play b4. I can also play e3. b4 does look kind of right. Knight d3. I'll, I'm just going to go b4. Why not? No need to overthink it. Just go play b4 and play good chess. Do draws run adoption? Yeah, yeah. Adoption is like 5 in a row or 10 in a row. McDoption is 5. Uh, regular adoption is 10. That's that's how it goes. Plays knight f8. How do you know it's a draw with correct play? Well, we don't know that for a fact, but... I'm, well, I mean, computers are different than humans, obviously. I'm going to go here, maybe f4, e3. Let's go f4, e3, bishop, b2, basically. I'm going to play e3, consolidate the structure. Bishop, b2, and C b5 is my idea. Next move. My idea is good, yeah. Let's go here. Yeah, but what can you do when I play inaccurately? Yeah, of course, that's always the big question. Um... I kind of want to go b5 here, but is it a move or not? It kind of is, but it's not the move I want to play. So I'm going to go queen b3 and rook d1. I have b5. I have e4. No, let's play rook d1. Because knight b6, I can play e4 now. Not sure if it's right or not, but it looks... I mean, if I'm not playing e5, what am I really doing? I guess... Yeah, if I'm not playing e4, then what am I really playing for here? Oh, well, I guess he can take... Now, do I take with the bishop or do I take with the knight? I think. <sighs> Very hard to. Oh, man. This is. I'm going to take with a bishop. I, I really don't know which capture is correct. They both look very attractive. But this one feels right just because I have f5 ideas. That's the only reason I traded bishops is because I feel like f5 is here. Whereas if there was a bishop, there was no f5 push. Yeah, but f5, knight d4. So my whole idea was was uh, garbage. Doesn't work at all. Um, so I'll just retreat with my queen, maybe. Oh, I had knight c4 and f5. Maybe there was an idea, too. Let's go here. I'm going to play f5. He'll go knight g5. I'll trade. I'll go back. I give him a5, maybe. So then I can just trade. Not actually thrilled with my position objectively. I'm just going to go here. Knight's got a great outpost. Bishop c1's an idea here. And I guess I... I have rookie 6 maybe? 
No, I'm just going to go here. So There might have been some tactic he missed with this. Okay, let's just reroute uh, everything. Let's go here in rookie one. Knight c7, logical. I'm going to play here in queen f3, I guess is my idea. Uh, not that it's wonderful or anything. I, mean, I kind of feel like I need to need to do something here in this position right away. Knight b5. Okay, I can go just back and knight c4. Have a4 at some moment too. Oh, I also have d5, which I completely forgot about. But it's not it's not a move at this particular junction. Just go here. This unfortunately is heading towards likely another draw. I mean, <sighs> I mean, you can reroute the bishop, but it doesn't really do anything. This is the problem. Everybody's position is kind of stuck here. I just take. Wait, why did I do that? Actually, I gave him 97. I guess I have g4, though. Go here. Got to stop b5. Got to move. Check. Yes, he blundered. There we go. We got the win.